Namaskar everyone. Welcome back to Shira's Corner. Today, uh, we're going to actually talk a little bit about the upcoming Nier game that uh, has been recently announced. So, titled Nier Replicant version something something, which we will see the trailer and stuff. So, this kind of a... Um, what can you say? Uh, uh, remake, revamp of the original Near Replicant game that was never released back in West. It was a uh, like exclusive title and didn't got released. What the West got for the PlayStation version version was the PlayStation uh, Near Gestalt. So. That is what uh, we all know as Nier. Now, what is Replicant and the trailer and everything will show. Or rather, we'll uh, see with you guys. And I'm gonna show you a couple of screenshots of the old Gestalt game to see the certain areas that has been shown on the trailer. So, yeah. Let's actually see the trailer first. So, let's see the trailer. So, the original Nia game was a game developed by Kavya and published by Square Enix in uh, around two, uh, 2010 for uh, PlayStation 3 and Xbox 360 for West, whereas for Japan, the Nia Gestalt was released in Xbox 360 and Near Replicant was released on the PS3 version and the release dates were in the April of uh, 2010 so what is notable about this uh, series was the fact other than Yoko Taro's uh, like work of course is uh, that it is a uh, it steams from the fifth ending of Dragon God and continues on on a forward path of storyline which continues up till uh, what we know as in the uh, Automata. So, and also not to mention Keiji Okabe and his uh, studio Monaka's song is like incredible. <sighs> that is not something we can do. But the main difference uh, that we know regarding Near Gestalt and Near Applicant, which Near Gestalt you guys have played, some of you definitely have played, who those who own PS3 or Xbox 360, is that the main protagonist of Near Gestalt is uh, Near himself taken as a role of a father, whereas Yuna as his daughter. In the replicant version, we see Nier as a young boy, as a brother, and Juna as his sister. So this relationship 
scenario is the main difference that Gestalt and Replicant had. Now this remastered version, we do not know what exactly is being remastered other than the, of course, graphics and all those. Those are not actually the thing to talk about, right? But we do not know if there will be any change in the storyline and stuff like those yet. So for now, I'll say this is a wel very welcome step for core near fans who loved Gestalt and certainly would have loved playing a uh, playing replicant. Yeah, I guess even if there will not be a change in storyline because the storyline was also loved by many people like me. I know that it, uh, Gestalt didn't actually receive that highly anyway but even then the storyline was quite certainly loved by me and many other fans i'm sure some of us can uh, definitely relate to that so let's just go and see the trailer again and just compare a little bit parts of what it looked like in the previous near game I mean Gestalt, uh, through some screenshots I have tried to search on the internet and uh, marvel upon, I guess. <laughs> right. So. This place is that uh, factory kind of uh, place. Uh, if uh, any one of you played uh, near Gestalt, then you may uh, feel this place very familiar with. Uh, if you remember the origin, I couldn't find a screenshot of this place the uh, from the original title. So if we, any one of you remember this place, then you can relate to how it uh, feels like now yeah so this place if you remember was that desert city kind of part where uh, we had that uh, tribal uh, place remember guys I got a little screenshots here uh, a gif uh, from if you guys remember this is a little bit part of what it looked like uh, and near Gestalt and another screenshot I believe this one see this is how it looked like uh, in Gestalt of course there would will be a very much big of graphical improvement that is uh, no doubt but I'm just comparing the two areas and how it was and how it is uh, in the trailer we couldn't ca get the screenshots of the actual places shown in the trailer, but uh, okay, let's uh, improvise a little bit, I guess. Then this place, guys, if you remember this place, uh, this was uh, the meadow, that field where a lot of those... Uh, enemies uh, uh, those uh, thingies kind of spawned around and uh, had, we had to just move from this bridge had to come down from uh, here this place and then go to that place and go up there was uh, two ladders and in between due to the bridge being broken we had to move around so this is uh, the inside, not exactly that place, but this is uh, the inside uh, of uh, that area, kind of, how it was back in the original Gestalt, where you can see near Gestalt's main character being set here. Uh, so, yes, that's how it looked. And, uh, yeah. This is how it was. It was. There are two screenshots I could find of this place. Mm. Yeah. 
And this, guys, was that uh, first area we came in when Gestalt started. I am guessing it will be the like it will be the same if uh, Replicant follows the same pathway of storytelling and all. But if uh, there will be any change, then of course we'll see. But this is that uh, snow area where the game originally started when Nier fought against those enemies and inside yuna was uh, just staying inside and uh, then uh, there were grimoire voice and grimoire noir yeah so this was that starting zone that in the cold winter the that zone <sighs> the significance of this zone man <laughs> right And certainly, was it a thousand year lie that lived for eternity? Certainly, wasn't it? So, uh, on the original trailer, we all got already got confirmation of uh, this near replicant version 1.224744871139. Releasing on Steam, PlayStation 4, as well as Xbox. So, <sighs> hype to all fans, I guess. Uh, those who loved uh, the original Nier and those who was introduced in the uh, series through Automata and uh, are looking forward to the original version being remastered. So, yeah, finally we can play this and personally i'm also very much hyped because i did never had a console so i couldn't play the original near games so i'm certainly very much hyped for this one to come out but we do not have any release date yet so yeah that is something that will have to cover up later when we actually got confirmation about that but yeah uh, that was it for the video and uh, i hope all of us will be very much anticipating this title when it comes out and i know whether there will be any deviation of the original course or there won't be but i guess we will uh, certainly enjoy this ride of the remastered near replicant no matter whether there will be or not can i agree with you guys right rather can you guys agree with me so yeah that was it for the for today today tonight wherever you are and uh, stay safe stay well and i'll see you later someday another video or another live stream should that happen stay safe good night